Okay, so now we're going to talk about how we calculate the percentage of weight loss in pediatrics. This is really very important because so many of our children present with dehydration and depending on the type of dehydration will determine how quickly we replace their fluid loss. Um, but this is on the metrology test so you do need to know how to do this. The most important thing to remember is to work in like units. So if the example says that your patient weighs uh, weighed 13 pounds, uh, 3 ounces, and now comes to the hospital with clinical signs of dehydration, and they weigh the child, and the child now weighs 12 pounds, 7 ounces, we need to figure out how much weight did this child lose? And then what is that total percentage of their healthy pre-illness weight? Because we categorize dehydration severity based on the percentage of weight loss. So the easiest thing to do is let us figure out how many ounces the child lost. So we know that there are 16 ounces in one pound. So the child, before he was sick, weighed 13 times 16 plus 3. So he weighed 211 ounces. And now he weighs 12 times 16, 12 times 16 plus 7, he weighs 199 ounces. And we subtract to figure out how many ounces he lost. He lost 12 ounces. So the next step is to take what has been lost, 12 ounces is to the total pre-illness weight in ounces times 100 because we are figuring out a percentage. So we take 12 divided by 211 times 100, and this child lost 5.6, it says 5.687, so we could say that rounds up to 5.69%. to, let's see how old? Yeah, he's only 13 pounds. He's not a, a, a child, he's still an infant. He's in the mild dehydration range. Okay, so to review, let's figure out how much they have lost, and you put the lost weight over the total weight before they were ill, times 100 in order to get a percentage, and do the math. Let's do one more. We have a child who weighs, who did weigh, 37 pounds, four ounces. And now they come to the hospital and they weigh in and they are 35 pounds, 13 ounces. Let's convert it all to ounces. 37 times 16. 37 times 16 is 592 plus 4. 
So he was 596 ounces before he got sick. And now he's 35 times 16 equals 560 plus 13. He now weighs 573 ounces. Two, 27 ounces. That's a good chunk of change. Um, 23 ounces. We take what has been lost, 23 ounces, over his pre illness weight, 596 ounces, times 100, 23 divided by 560. Oh, no, sorry. 23 divided by 596 times 100. He lost 3.85%. And a child, 3% is considered mild, 6% is moderate, and 9% is severe. You'll learn that when we talk about dehydration. So the most important thing to remember when you're calculating percentage weight loss, you're going to need to multiply by 100. And you need to take the weight lost in comparison to their original weight. Times 100 to get your percentage. 